If you are writing GATE AE 2025, then this video is for you. Because a lot of students have doubt, Sir, you have taught Engineering Mathematics for GATE and ESE 2025, but this course is common to all branch, whereas my branch is GATE Aerospace. So how will I know which chapters I have to study, which chapters I have to leave? Moreover, which topics I should leave for the GATE 2025? So in today's video, we are going to address this problem and don't worry, this IIT Rurki official website is there in front of me and this might fool you if you just study the titles, Linear Algebra, Calculus, Differential Equation. So never ever see the titles, read the topics given because you will understand the syllabus by reading the topic, okay? Now, if you have not downloaded the Shredding Gen Study Simplified app, app links are given in the comment section. Do download and visit the courses. There are two courses. One is taught in Hindi, other is in English. English means everything is in English. The speaking style, the writing style, the slides, everything is in English. Whereas Hindi means मैं बातें करूंगा हिंदी में जैसे अभी आपसे बातें कर रहा हूं पर कंटेंट की जो स्लाइड है जो चीजें जैसे आपको यहां पर इंग्लिश में दिखाई दे रही है वैसी रहेगी ये चीज काफी स्टूडेंट्स को कंफर्टेबल लगती है वेरस इन इंग्लिश दो स्टूडेंट्स हु आर फ्रॉम साउथ फील्स वेरी कंफर्टेबल अंडरस्टूड नाउ इफ यू विजिट द कंटेंट सेक्शन यू विल सी एट चैप्टर्स इन टोटल व्हिच इज कॉमन टू ऑल ब्रांच सिलेबस linear algebra, calculus, probability, differential equation, vector calculus, complex variable, numerical method and transform theory, right? Now, as per gate aerospace student, which chapters I have to study, which chapters I have to leave? See carefully, gate 2025, IIT Roorkee, official syllabus, where they are saying you have two section, core topics and special topics. What are the weightage? Core topics has a weightage of 90% of the questions are asked from the core topics and only 10% questions are asked from the special topics. So this is the most important. This is the least important because the ratio is 90-10. Understood? Now, if you see carefully in the core topics, we have linear algebra, calculus and differential equation. So a lot of students think, oh, so basically I have to study the linear algebra, and then uh, sir told us what to study next calculus and then we have to study differential equation only three chapters we have to study no that is wrong interpretation what you have to see is the topics now in linear algebra we have vector algebra so vector algebra means indirectly basics of vector calculus okay so basics of vector calculus is taught if you see carefully we have vector calculus here click on that watch the lecture basics of vector calculus part one and part two okay then we have matrix algebra system of linear equation rank of matrix eigenvalues and eigenvectors so by reading this topic a lot of student thinks oh sir we do not have determinant then right in your linear algebra lecture you have taught us determinant inverse of matrix and all these things which is not present here you are doing a mistake matrix algebra means basics of matrices which means determinant inverse all these concepts are there here okay and moreover when you study this advanced concepts like system of linear equation and eigenvalues and eigenvectors all these basics are required yes all these basics which i have taught here basics of matrices operation on matrices determinant inverse all these are needed to study this advanced topic so ultimate conclusion for this chapter is basics of vector calculus you have to study second every content from this content list you have to study miscellaneous concepts part one and part two also you have to study okay so this is your first conclusion linear algebra folder you have to study completely now coming to the next which is calculus now in calculus you have to be very specific so function of single variable limits continuity differentiability mean value theorem chain rule partial derivative maxima minima so you might be thinking yes there is no integration in our syllabus wait a second you are doing a mistake again i will tell you where okay but let me go to the content folder calculus lecture you might be seeing your first second third a Taylor series is also there because it would be useful to solve the limit question. So you have to study this. Then derivatives, then maxima, minima. So up till seven lectures, you know that as per the official syllabus, it is matching. So we will study. What about this 8, 9, 10? What about this 8, 9, 10, 11, 12? The rest. So 
let me make it very clear when they are further saying this integration this integration then you have line surface volume integral these are nothing but indirectly double and triple integration so to study the double triple integration all these things are taught here so 8 9 10 11 12 all this you have to study so again no skipping allowed from this folder okay so i hope you got the idea so no skipping allowed from this folder which means uh, in calculus also complete folder you have to study coming to the next now the yellow part which i have highlighted this is what this is not calculus this is vector calculus gradient divergence curl directional derivative integration line surface volume integral theorem of stokes gauss green's theorem this is nothing but the vector calculus now vector calculus is studied once your calculus basics are clear because vector calculus is an advanced topic it says you don't have just uh, the scalar thing you also have the direction involved so when you have magnitude plus a direction it becomes vector calculus so to solve that you need the concepts of calculus first hence you can see here this is a trap they are not mentioning a different uh, chapter as vector calculus but in the calculus itself they are keeping those vector calculus topics so basically if you see my lecture series now this is the vector calculus folder now you have to study everything okay so vector span and gate pyqs of that you can uh, skip because those are not mentioned here so one benefit you get you can skip the lecture 7 it's not there in your syllabus okay it's there in the computer science syllabus but not in the gate a aerospace syllabus so you can skip that otherwise you have to study everything from vector calculus understood if understood uh, then uh, what's next we have differential equation everything you have to study first order differential equation higher order partial differential equation so in the folder each and every topic seven videos are there you have to watch coming uh, to the special topics so special topics are nothing but the whole chapter itself Fourier series Laplace transform means transform theory so go to the folder and then check the transform theory completely you have to study okay then we have numerical method for linear and non-linear algebraic equations numerical integration and differentiation this is nothing but the numerical method so again you have to go to the numerical method folder you have to study everything okay then we have complex analysis which is nothing but complex variable folder so you have to study everything then finally we have probability and statistics which means the probability folder so you have to study everything okay so as uh, per the gate uh, a 2025 syllabus you have to watch all the eight chapters see count linear algebra calculus differential equation vector calculus transform theory numerical method complex variable probability so eight chapters everything you have to study the only part which you can skip is that vector span which is not mentioned here so yes that part can be skipped otherwise you have to study each and every topic from this folder understood if yes this is how your official syllabus was thank you for watching this video